Hi, I'm Tomas. And I'm Kimberly. And we are Loft 906, a DIY lifestyle channel. And welcome to our holiday mantle makeover challenge. It was a challenge. It is a challenge slash yeah. competition. Yeah, it was a fun competition. Friendly. I think I'm gonna win. Yeah, so <laughs> I, I'm okay with it being his win because the challenge was to come in the lowest on budget. Yes, yeah, that was a challenge. That was a my challenge for sure. <laughs> are you, what are you, are you afraid that he didn't make it? I, I am, I am, I'm a little concerned. <laughs> We will reveal the totals at the end. Like we'll see what these numbers are. Yeah, we're gonna count up those digits, and uh, we'll we'll just see. In the end, this was fun. That's yeah. the, really the reality of it. This was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was. I enjoyed the challenge of just trying to make it look full and lush and yeah. luxurious and save a few dollars at the same time. Mm -hmm. I know some things. I, I guess I was like, oh well, I could make that, but I'm gonna buy it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's where I'm going to be able to add on to his man hours of True. at least the Christmas trees. The trees are gorgeous, by the way. They're awesome. They only took two days. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> So the inspiration for my mantle came from a Better Homes and Gardens coffee table book that I found probably three months and ago. Clearly, my theme is gold. And I originally thought that I was gonna go all gold. And as I got into it, that seemed a little, I, I needed to soften it up a little bit. So I did add a little bit of white, little kind of creamy white in there. I really wanted to hand make as many of the holiday decorations as possible. So I was able to make the popsicle stick Christmas trees. The gold twig wreath on the canvas and the star garland made out of cut up toilet paper rolls is that all i made no that i shouldn't say that's all that took I, it <laughs> took a long time my favorite place to shop for holiday decor is at home at home is where i found these adorable owls i love these deer the this beautiful gold bottle with the, the gold glittery feathers came from at home i'm so happy with the way this turned out for the amount of money that I spent, I really think it looks expensive. It's just dripping with gold and glitter, and I'm really proud of it, and I hope you like it too. It's like magic. The mantle behind us has changed. <laughs> my inspiration basically was my house. I have quite a bit of black, you know, in several of my rooms in my house. It made sense for me to do some of the more traditional colors. Well, the most traditional holiday colors, and that's red and green. And I added the ivory and black for a different touch. I think it looks beautiful. It looks really good. Like it. Yeah. You like it? I, I love that it has... A traditional feel mm -hmm. but yet it's very original for my challenge I wanted to focus on artwork as my DIY projects and I wanted to find things that were going to be easy for me yet definitely easy for you guys out there in two to three steps the first piece is the Christmas tree that has it's the most wonderful time of the year What's the next one? Uh, oh, the Peace, Love, and Joy. I found a really cool canvas print, cut out this beautiful reindeer, and I sprinkled glitter 
all over it. Well, to go into where I found my items for my mantle, I used At Home, Michaels, and Pure One. I was able to find some super cute reindeer at Pier 1 that had the little red plaid, which was a part of my red, black, and green theme. All of my DIY projects were done by grabbing crafts from Michaels. All of the ready-made pieces were from At Home. I mean, At Home had a section, an aisle, that had 75% off all framed wall art and I was just going crazy going through all this stuff. I was able to, you know, I guess work within my low budget to win this challenge <laughs> to figure out ways to make artwork out of what someone else would just pass by. All right, it's the moment of truth. We get to reveal how much we each spent on our mantle projects. You wanna go first or you want me to go first? Uh, well, <laughs> you go first. All right. <laughs> I spent a total of $64.32. Really? Yeah. You spent $64. I did. And 22 cents, guys. <laughs> I spent $158. Now, given the man hours that he used and his day rate is at least $650. This is true because I feel like your <laughs> projects were shorter in time versus mine. Yeah. Those damn popsicles. <laughs> <laughs> and the challenge is done. How do you feel? I'm really, I'm really happy. Are I'm you? happy with both of our projects. Me too. Me too. We, we both fun. did a good job. It was I fun. Think. Just to see it all come together. You know, it's just like to start out with an inspiration or an idea and then you're going out shopping and you're trying to find cool projects to do that really complete the look. Right. Yeah. And then once it comes together, it's like, okay, we did that. Each of us brought different parts of our personality out in our mm -hmm. projects. Mm -hmm. I can definitely see your personality in yours and mm -hmm. I feel like mine reflects my personality really well. And I love that. Is that why you went along with me putting my reindeer sideways on my canvas? <laughs> like, a little yeah. crazy. <laughs> What'd you say? He's got the gangster lean? He's got that gangster lean, yeah. <laughs> and the end result was some wonderfulness. Yes. yes. We hope you guys like it all. We do. We hope you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. And for a little more detail on our DOI projects, you can visit our blog at loft906.com. Mm -hmm. Please like and subscribe. We'll do our best to answer your questions in a timely manner, but we will be answering those questions. And thanks for watching. Thanks for loving us. We appreciate you. All right. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Bye. This hair doesn't look too... Mm -hmm. Puffy on the side up there, like. Oh, honey, I take away all your puff. <laughs> <laughs>